And you're on him. And like if he had done that and he sat down, well, now you come after him. And so it's here. Notice I've still got those bone shields in front of me. The whole body spring. One of the things that you'll find, by the way, that the, that the Kun Tao is blasting in there with the punch, with the form, with the elbow, with the body, with going th into and through the space, going into and through the space, and with the knees and the legs getting in there, is that you'll get multiple hits off of your getting in there at one shot. So you'll do like one contact, as it were, or one kind of kind of going in, but you'll have anywhere from three to five, six, seven, eight hits that are automatically kind of happening. And so a way to look at that in simple terms would be he's here, whatever, and I'm doing this. And again, I'm not in Kung Tao now, but I go there. Now notice the first hit, come to this side doing this. The first hit was here with that. So I hit with this part and the punch and my body and my knee, and notice it's moving him all over the place, just coming in like this. And then when I step with my second one on in there, it went ahead and brought him down as I collided him with my body. There's already a look trying to get an, an arm based kind of a break. There's a pin to the floor off the knee. Come back this way a step. There's a pin to the floor off of my knee. There's a break to his elbow, or with a downward shot here, and or the step, or the step. This way, coming on into the posture. And notice the way that that comes off at speed is it looks like... Bah! Because, bang, and body. And you notice I'm on his toe with this one. Sorry, you all right? Oh, good. There's my knee into it. There's my hand on the throat already. As I turn him, I've already got the neck break, the shoulder break, the arm break. And I step on in and through there. Can you see this Okay folding it and down on top with this part to finish because I'm already there to the head and or jumping up and turning across it. this kind of a thing but it's the way it crashes in there with all of the tools in place slowly okay and then all together slowly bang and notice that other one was covering that notice the head flying to the floor so that's part of the reason we're doing it so carefully I've got both my knees in the position to, to, to force his knee to the floor. I've got the arm break that forces the head onto the floor. I've got a leg break right there. Can you see that okay? I've got the ability to go ahead and step up here and force the arm break. And I've let him change his position. The reality is you wouldn't. And then everything slammed down there. And or the head, right? Or you'd be standing on this one taking the head with the next one as you continue on out the door. You know, off and out. But, so I kind of walked it through there slow. Be careful. You saw him, because the body parts still are getting a little bit, even though we're taking it carefully. All right. 